Hi everybody, it's John Alexandrov, and I have a very important question for you today. Are you cheap? I really want you to stop and think about that. Are you cheap? Now there's a difference between being somebody who is thrifty, value-oriented, or, or cheap. So for example, people who are cheap are people who are in the mindset of not sharing, stingy, hoarding, always thinking they don't have enough, not making charitable contributions, not spending time with their nieces and nephews or children or grandchildren, significant other. There are people that are just cheap. They don't get it. They're so afraid and so fearful that they're not gonna have access to the next dollar or to the next item or whatever it may be. They just fundamentally have cheap thinking. They'll, they buy stuff for $3 that breaks down in a week when they could have bought something for $6 that'll last a year. Stop and think about that. Now there are people who are value oriented and there are people who are thrifty slash value oriented and those are the people who spend money but get the most value out of the money that they spend. So yes, if you could buy something for $10 that somebody else is paying $15 for and you find a way to do that and you get the same utilization, you get the same enjoyment, you get the same fun out of it, well great, spend the $10 instead of the 15. But don't do it because you're cheap. Don't do it because you're just trying to save a buck here or there and that item's gonna break down anyways or you're not gonna get enjoyment out of it anyways. Be a value-oriented thinker. Say, what's the most I can get for my money rather than what's the least amount of money I can spend to cheap my way out of this? Because if you have the cheap mentality, you're gonna be that way about everything. But if you have the value-oriented mentality, over the course of your lifetime, you can save thousands and thousands of dollars, but still get the same value and enjoyment of people spending two times or three times or four times as much money. And it kind of goes back to the video that we shot a week or two ago on being fine-tuning your money consciousness. I'm not saying to just be blindly spending your money. What I am saying is when you have your money allocated for something, get the most out of it that you possibly can, but do it with joy, do it with happiness, do it with gratefulness, do it with graciousness. Don't do it from the perspective of, eh, I really couldn't afford that anyway, so I cheaped out on it. All right? So I want you to think about your mentality. Are you va value oriented with graciousness? or you're cheap because you're stingy, I want you in the value-oriented category because the more you're like that, the more money will come your way.